Ever found yourself trapped in a memory that seems so real, yet reality insists otherwise? This intriguing phenomenon, known as the Mandela Effect, has left many of us questioning our own recollections, and at times, even the fabric of reality itself. The Mandela Effect refers to the curious situation where a large group of people remember events, facts, or cultural phenomena differently from how they actually occurred. Named after Nelson Mandela, many people distinctly remember him dying in prison during the 1980s, when in fact he lived until 2013. There are divergent theories trying to explain this mind-bending phenomenon. Some attribute it to simple memory errors and social reinforcement. It's easy to see how our brains, being the complex machinery they are, might sometimes misremember a detail. And when we hear others affirming our misremembered detail, it reinforces that memory, making it seem even more real. Then there are those who suggest a rather more tantalizing theory. The idea that the Mandela Effect is evidence of alternate realities or parallel universes. Proponents of this theory argue that our collective false memories are actually real memories from alternate timelines that have somehow merged or crossed over with our own. A more fringe theory even suggests that the Mandela Effect could be the result of manipulation of the space-time continuum, possibly by advanced technologies or experiments conducted by entities such as CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. Each theory presents its own compelling arguments and sparks its own set of questions. The memory error theory is backed by substantial psychological research, offering a grounded and plausible explanation. The alternate realities theory, while less supported by traditional science, opens up fascinating possibilities about the nature of reality and our perception of it. And the space-time manipulation theory, while certainly the most controversial, fuels the fire of conspiracy theories and the allure of the unknown. In this exploration of the Mandela Effect, we've delved into the intriguing world of collective false memories and the theories that attempt to explain them. We've investigated the psychological perspective that chalks it up to memory errors and social reinforcement. We've delved into the captivating concept of alternate realities and parallel universes. And we've explored the controversial suggestion of manipulation of the space-time continuum. Whatever the true cause of the Mandela Effect, it remains a fascinating reminder of the fallibility of our memories and the mysteries of our reality. Whether you lean more towards the psychological explanations or find yourself drawn to the more speculative theories, one thing is clear. The Mandela Effect continues to baffle, intrigue and entertain us all. So, the next time you remember something that didn't quite happen the way you thought, take a moment to ponder. Is it a simple memory error, evidence of an alternate reality, or a ripple in the fabric of space-time? Only time, and perhaps more understanding of our complex universe, will tell. Remember to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more intriguing explorations into the mysteries of our world. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and stay curious.